I remember one time I was hanging out with the homies, chilling, having fun, and I say, yo, I gotta go to the gym today, I'm about to be out. And then my homie says, so you going to lift more weights? You already big, you don't need to lift more weights. And just, you could imagine how I thought in that moment. I'm like, that makes no sense. So I'm going to improve on something. I'm going to lift weights. And then when I get the result, I'm going to stop doing everything and just go back. See, that's why a lot of people aren't successful. They got the wrong mindset. You got to keep doing the thing. You got to want to improve at the thing. See, when I lift weights, when I go to the gym, I'm trying to improve on my form. I'm trying to improve on my reps, on my strength. I'm trying to improve everything. Every little nuance. I'm not just trying to lift to get the result and then quit. Because it's an infinite game. It never stops. And that's how self-improvement self is. You got to want it. You can't never stop. Never. Because improvement is your pathway to your higher self. You need to be improving every single day, every single hour of the day, every single waking moment. That is the reason why you're here. You're here to self-actualize. You're not here to just, oh, I'm just who I am. I'm the same person. I'm going to eat the same bullshit that I've been eating. I'm going to do the same reckless activities in pursuit of pleasure. No, that's not why you're here. You're here to grow. Look at everything around you. Just look at nature. Nature tells you everything about life. Look around. Everything is constantly growing. Everything is changing. Nothing remains the same. Trees grow. Then they lose their leaves and they grow more leaves. Then they die, but they spread seeds and the seeds grow. And, it, and it's like that. That's how life is. That's how you're supposed to be. Everything is growth. You should be wanting to be the greatest you possible. That's how you please God. That's how you become your higher self. That's how you get in the flow state. You don't have to accept having no money. You don't have to accept being broke. You don't have to accept being fat. You don't have to accept being out of shape. You don't have to accept the ideas that people give you. Accept yourself. Stop running from the growth. Stop run running from the work. Stop hanging around the same people that ain't going nowhere. That's not bettering your life in any way. You're just too afraid to let go of them. Because you're afraid to be alone. Quit that shit right now. Stop your vices. It only takes one decision. A real hard decision. Not hard in the terms of this is hard to do, but hard in like... I just need to make it quick. I'm not doing that shit no more. This, I'm not doing that shit no more. Write it down. That's all it takes. You should want to improve every day. Don't listen to nobody telling you that you shouldn't want to improve. Now, there is a nuance to it. Because when you're improving, you're improving your mindset. You're improving your health. You can improve your wealth, but you can't improve on your inner self, essentially, because you are already whole. But you can improve your way of thinking. See, learning is unlocking yourself. 
your higher self, everything that you learn. Every time you learn and something resonates with you, you're unlocking something within yourself. You're unlocking more of life. When you stay with a closed mind, when you stay in your bubble, not wanting to improve, not wanting to get better, you're not unlocking anything. It's like a video game. You keep unlocking more and more stuff, more and more levels. When you read, you're educating. You know what? The root word of educate means educo to unlock. It's unlocking something within you when you learn. So keep learning. Read, listen to books, podcasts, YouTube videos. Sit in silence as well. Sit in silence and really think. Meditate. Look at the wall. Take a day break from your phone. You should be improving every day. You should be growing every day. You should want to be rich. Being rich is the most noble thing that you can do. Because who can you help when you're broke? What can you really do? Do you want to live in struggle? Your wife got to go work for somebody else, take order from another man. Your kids got to live in poverty. You can't eat the food you want to. You can't eat healthy. You can't go to the gym. You can't travel. You can't. Being wealthy is the greatest thing you can accomplish. And that should be your main priority. So being wealthy monetary wise and being wealthy mind wise and health wise and relationship wise. But you shouldn't be out here just wanting to be mediocre. That's not how you live life. And anybody that tells you it's okay to be mediocre, they just don't want to see you shine for real. They just want you to stay the same, to stay regular. It's probably somebody successful so they can sell something to you so you can sit and watch their dumbass videos. 